let's go. Hello there, my name is Dan from NM Rocketry Reviews. Recently, as you saw before, we got to 100 subscribers. And because we made the promise that once we get to 100 subscribers, that we would do a weather balloon series, we're going to explain to you about all the details of the project today. So, let's get started. So, what will we be doing in this whole weather balloon project? So, we will be getting a weather balloon and attaching an Arduino payload along with some other things. Ballon. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, like I was saying before, we will be sending an Arduino payload along with a 360 camera up to around 80,000 feet close to space. The Arduino payload will include sensors that will measure humidity, um, barometric pressure, temperature data, along with acceleration data. So, Let's get into some details about the Arduino payload. So before we go into more stuff, just wanted to give a huge shout out to all you guys. We never thought that we'd be able to get 100 subscribers in this short amount of time. So thank you for all your support. Your subscriptions mean a lot to us. So now let's get back to the Arduino payload. All right, so um, the Arduino we're going to be using for this project is an Arduino Mega. This thing is crazy, it has 54 digital pins and 15 analog pins, which is insane. So this thing has way more power than we need. And just a quick tip, if you're um, planning to do this on your own, make sure you buy a stock Arduino, not um, a different company, because the stock Arduinos can handle temperatures down to negative 40 degrees Celsius, while um, other companies off-brand Arduino boards can only handle up to like zero degrees Celsius. But anyways, um, K9 Rocket Technologies, their channel link is down in the description, designed a PCB Arduino shield for us. You can see the design up here. So what that will do is we'll be able to just solder header pins on there and just stick it right on there and stick the sensors on there and we'll have a functional um, sensor computer thingy. So big shout out to K9 Rocket Technologies, thanks for that. So. Anyways, we're going to be also we're also going to be making a video of us assembling that PCB, so make sure you stay tuned for that. All right, so let me tell you guys a little bit about what we're going to be doing with the camera on this weather balloon. So, since the weather balloon rocks around a lot and it's not going to be super stable, we're not going to be using a traditional GoPro or action cam because the footage would look way too shaky and it just wouldn't look great. Instead, we are going to be using a 360 camera, which basically just has two 180 degree lenses on each side, and it'll stitch the image together to create a full 360 video. The reason we're using this type of camera is because since it's filming 360 degrees, it has amazing stabilization built in, and that's going to get us nice, smooth footage for our launch. We are still currently looking into what camera to buy, but we're likely going to get something from Insta360. Alright, so there's a cool little twist in this project. You can be sharing this weather balloon experience with us. Down in the description, there's a link to this Google form. In that form, you can fill out a dream that you have or an inspirational quote, and you can fill out your name if you'd like. We're going to be printing out all of those, and we're going to put it inside the payload bay. That way, your quote and maybe your name, if you want to put that on there, can go up to almost space. So check out that Google form if you want to have a part in this weather balloon experience. So we're going to keep updating you guys on our progress. Our next video is likely going to be where we uh, make a shield and we assemble the shield for this Arduino. That might be a live stream, it might be a video, who knows, but we'll keep you guys updated. Check out our Facebook if you want more frequent updates about this project. And also check out our Patreon and our website. All the links are down in the description. We're also now selling merch on our Patreon. If you're interested, check that out. So don't forget to subscribe, hit that like button, and send all your comments and questions in the comment section. So other than that, have a great day.